And unfortunately, you can't mine it with bombs anymore. Holy shit. Hello, people of the internet. Spaz here. Welcome to part two of the master mode for the worthy increased spawn rate experience or the true master mode experience. Oh wait, no. Yes, today we're starting off wrong, getting loot from the goblin. That is the worst possible noise I could ever hear. Alright guys. We're gonna make it back to the goblin. And we're not gonna die. Mission success. Let's give some reforges onto my gear. Cause why not? Blue half and half, warding menacing. Like always. That's how I roll. I'm heading to the corruption. Because the Eater of Worlds needs to go away. I'll probably, um, be maining range in pretty hard mode. I just typically go that route in pretty hard mode. Oh. Hello. I need some bombs. I hate how much damage they do. I need some bombs because... Otherwise, I don't know how I'm supposed to blow this area out. Oh. Goodbye. I'm gonna go find bombs if it's the last thing I do. Finally made it into the jungle, guys. What a warm welcome I have here. Oh, hell. Why did I do that? Traveling scalpers here, guys. Ooh. Give me your wood. How is one supposed to make an arena here? Alright, you guys need to chill. Just take a deep breath and chill. I'm just blowing up your... home. There's nothing wrong with that. If I saw a gold, a gold spangled player come and blow up my home, I would not object in the slightest. What's wrong with you people? Alright guys, we ran into a speed bump here. I was trying to make an arena, you know, peacefully, and the Eater of Worlds would not leave me alone. It was very problematic, so it's time to become a hacker. You'll see what I mean in a minute. A minute for you, probably several hours for me. Welcome back, guys. I built this nice, giant-ass arena for us to fight the Eater of Worlds in. And my secret strategy was to put walls behind the entire arena. Because doing this will make mobs not spawn. No one ever specified that was cheating, so too bad. But everything's in order. Let's fight the Eater of Worlds. <laughs> Jester arrows are gonna make this fight pretty breezy, I'd say. I'm gonna take this opportunity to get around my boy here. Can you move please? Thank you.
got it, guys. We even got the pet, too. Epic. I love the Eater of Worlds pet. Let's make the goods. The goods. Hammer upgrade. Hammer time. The next thing we're gonna do is just... I think probably get a meteorite to spawn. I'll mine that. So I want. The star cannon. The star spangled cheese stick returns. Here it is. The meteor. I'm not looking forward to mining this. This is going to be very bad. And unfortunately, you can't mine it with bombs anymore. Holy shit. We're setting our spawn point. Unconscious man, hello. I'm setting my spawn point here. Otherwise, this is going to get very, very bad. Nice. Definitely make the ham axe. I can get rid of both of those. We need the arms dealer to get the mini shark. There he is, guys, my boy Dante. How you doing, my bro? Had to make another room. didn't have the musket in my inventory, so. Thank you, good sir. Yes. Yes. Yeah! Let's make a better boat. While we're here. Before we head out. Alright guys, so I'm here at the dungeon. I'm gonna be making an I'm gonna be making an arena for Skeletron of course, so just get that ready. I'll cut back when I'm done. Okay guys, it is time for Skeletron and of course he's in this ditch. Uh, that's not, that's not good. Alright, well, let's go. We're already about to die. That, that's, oh my god. This is horrible. For the love of God. I just finished putting walls on this entire arena. And let me tell you, when you spend multiple hours placing and placing and placing and doing nothing else, You realize how much time actually can mean to a person. Because, oh my god, this was hell. Look at this shit. Look at it. It is nighttime, people. Um, uh, no, 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 come back, come back, come back. Up, up. We should have a pretty normal Skeletron experience now. Besides the fact that I never fight him in an arena that looks like this. But I've given myself 350 stars. 
with the star cannon because I didn't want to go like overkill since I have stars research of course. This really the star cannon is very overpowered. It really is. Finish him off. Nice. We got a Chippy's couch. Epic. Got the book of skulls too. That's real nice. Real, real nice. Where's that Chippy's couch? Give it to me. I am placing this in my spawn room. Remarkable. This has been a very painful episode to make. I'm not going to lie. And I'm editing it here because of that. So, uh, thank you for watching, guys. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Goodbye. <laughs>